guys agree there? Come in, Isaac. Oh, God. I'm so sorry, Isaac. Look at the time difference. Oh, no, I'll call you okay. back later. It's okay. <clears throat> How you doing? Good. You're right, Isaac. The Ishmer is a great ship. I am so lucky to be serving aboard her. I'll enjoy it while it lasts. You know they're going to decommission her next year. Isaac. Thank you. For what? For just pushing me to do this. I, if it weren't for you, I never would have made it this far, because you made me stick with it. I'll just remember, I'm giving you up for six months so you can do this. You know what? We must be getting out of range there, Mike. Isaac? Isaac, can you hear me? Look, I'm going to call you back as soon as I can, okay? Isaac! Isaac! You were drifting away for a moment there, Mr. Clark. I believe you were telling me about your nightmares that you've been having. About your dead girlfriend. What was her name? Nicole. I didn't want it to end like this. I really wanted to see you again. Just once. I loved you. I always loved you. Yes. Nicole Brennan. She was a senior medical officer stationed aboard a Planet Cracker class vessel. Ishimura. USG Ishimura, yes. Part of a mining operation on Aegis 7. I understand communications went down shortly after their arrival. You were part of the repair mission. A mission for which you volunteered, am I right? What did you find aboard that ship, Isaac? I found something. What did they find aboard the ship, Isaac? The marker. Did you have contact with this marker? It made you see things, didn't it? Things you didn't want to see. It spoke to me. What did it say, Isaac? What did it say to you, Isaac? Isaac! Isaac, can you hear me, Isaac? Isaac Clark. Repeat, I have him. Great work, Franco. Be careful. He's been out a long time. Oh, yeah. Okay, good. Good, good. Steady, steady, steady. We gotta get you out of this straitjacket. Where, where am I? All right, I, I know you're confused right now. I can explain everything, but you gotta trust me, okay? Listen, you're in terrible, terrible danger. <laughs>
Yeah. My eyes looking much better today, yeah? Don't you think? <laughs> it hurts. It still hurts. Yes, I'll schedule you for another session tomorrow. No, no, no I, I don't think I'm ready. I, I don't think I can take another session. I don't... There. First thing tomorrow. Now let's talk about what you saw today. Come on, Strauss. I'm here to help you. It was black. Deep black and glowing red with symbols. Symbols whispered to me. And what did the symbols whisper to you? Come on, Strauss. What? It was just sharp. It was just sharp, but it put so much stuff in my head, so much shit in my head. There's no more room for anything. I can't remember what she looks like. I can't remember what she looks like. The symbols, Strauss. What did the symbols tell you? They told me that it wasn't my fault. I didn't kill him. They didn't deserve this. And I didn't deserve this. <laughs> Fucker. Put Mr. Strauss back in stasis. Suggest his medication up 30 milligrams. And we'll try another session first thing in the morning. Subject is Nolan Strauss, Section 158. This is not a drill. Type it out. Come on, man. Thank you, boy. I remember you. <laughs> I said we all the key subjects need to be eliminated, Listen. terminated. <laughs> Which one more? Listen to me, man. What matters? Listen to what me! Matter? We can both get out of here. Just just cut me out of this straitjacket. No one's getting out of here alive. alive. Don't do it. There's no escaping from what I've done. <laughs> take it easy, buddy. Just take it easy. The rig is red. It's red. It's a health pack and a flashlight in that wall locker. You should grab them. Go ahead. Take it. I won't be needing it anymore. Isaac, we're all gonna burn for what we did to you. Dana, I'm the one trying to rescue you. Why? What's going on? You're suffering from a unique form of dementia, Isaac. Something you contracted on age seven. How do you know that? How do you know all this about me? Your dementia will kill you. But if you can get here, I can treat you and get you to safety. Why should I trust you? Because I'm not the one shooting at you. Fuck. Just follow the route I'm sending you. Like nail clippers and tweezers. 
The research teams have all been notified of the discovery. Calm down. You. I'll cut you out of there. You. Is that a tissue Thank laser? God. A plasma Please. cutter? Come help me. Oh my god! Fuck. What the fuck are you oh, doing? Shit. Help! I'm trying! Help! I'm trying! I'm trying! Thank <laughs> you. 
Isaac, it's Dana. You have to dismember the creatures to stop them. I know. I've had a lot of practice. Just try to stay in one piece. Thanks. I do need your help. Talk to me. Look, Isaac, we don't have to be friends. But like it or not, we're stuck together. Tideman's your enemy, not me. All right, I found you a new route. Fine. So where the hell am I? How did another Necromorph outbreak get started? You're on Titan Station orbiting Saturn. As for the outbreak... <laughs> Shit! Tideman's jamming my signal!
Tideman found you floating in space near Aegis 7 and brought you here for study. Why can't I remember anything? The marker you found imprinted your brain with a self-replicating signal. The longer you're awake, the more the signal spreads. It's killing you, Isaac. Tyburn tried to keep it in check with memory suppressants. You said you could fix it, right? Only if you reach me in time. Tram station, get moving.